Welcome, all my beautiful signs and souls of the Zodiac. I'm Brenda, Brenda Tarot, and I'm here again today to bring you your Oracle messages for October the 16th, 2019. Again, you know, I always thank you for your interest in my channel, for viewing, liking, sharing, and subscribing. When you do subscribe, be sure you click the bell button and the like button, and you'll get notified immediately when these are produced and out on open air for you to view here on YouTube. As you know, this is a general reading for everybody and the collective. Some of it may resonate with you. If it does, run with it. If it doesn't, throw it out into the universe. If you want clarity, accuracy, and answers to any questions, then I invite you to click the little icon in the top right-hand corner of this video, and it will direct you right into my website where you can see the services that I offer. All the other information, my beautiful signs and souls of the Zodiac, is posted below this video. Let's see what we have here, starting our week. You've been given the, the Power of Surrender card here, and this is Surrender to Worry. Make a commitment not to lead an anxiety-driven life or today. <clears throat> when worries arise, breathe them out of your body. Focus on the power of your heart and have faith that Spirit is guiding you always. So today the message is, don't worry so much, okay? Throw it out into the universe and the divine and ask them to release you of it. Take it away so that you can function 100% today on any situations that you're dealing with at work, in your family, in your relationships, in your personal life. Try not to let fear and worry lead you today on your path. The second card you've been given here from the Ascended Masters, and I apologize, my deck, I'll have to see if I can get a new one, but Doreen Virtue is not making cards anymore, and I will have to see if I can get another deck. These have done me well, and for many years, and I hate to part with my beautiful cards. They have so much beautiful energy in them, so please be distracted from the dog ear that's here, and take the message, and this is the message of health and healing. And this is telling me basically that all illness or injury is, is healed or is healing for some of you. And you are healers yourself, some of you perhaps. It is a good and safe time for you to change to a healing career for some of you. Maybe some of you are going to be studying healing modalities. So, you know, your divine healing power has awakened and you feel compelled now to help others to heal. Just as you've been healed, so too do you want others to enjoy health and vitality. You're supported in making life changes so that you can continue to heal yourself and others. Let go of any fears or restrictive thinking to fully open to the miracles of healing. So some of you may be going through some health issues. Know that uh, things are going to improve. This is a card of positive energy, not negative, of course. And some of you may be tapping into your own natural healing modalities. And you may want to get involved in some sort of healing. I mean, you know, you guys all know that I'm a healing uh, uh, an element for healing myself being a Reiki master practitioner. But there's many modalities of natural healing out there. Perhaps some of you are actually studying to become a doctor or a physician or some sort of therapist where there is healing. And know that this card is a calling. It's calling to you to realize that you need to step up or perhaps that you are absolutely aligned on the right path for you to move forward in towards a healing modality. But take the message today that, that you have the ability to heal yourself, okay, and to try to heal others if you get into that uh, healing modality. But today this is about you healing and other people around you that perhaps have not been feeling well. You've been given from the Wisdom Oracle deck You've been given a change in the wind. And this is about change coming in. And sometimes it isn't always what we want. And it kind of stops us in our tracks. It's a sense that unseen change has been initiated right now. And you may have to prepare for the changes. Maybe there's a storm coming in. Something that you didn't expect. Negative energy. And your awareness that your plans are not on firm ground. Feeling a shift. Uncertainty about which direction the winds will blow. So again, this is about worry. This is about you, uh, you know, you might have something uh, switch up your day to day that you hadn't planned. Um, you know, it's only human nature to want certainty and to resist any change. A lot of us don't like change. And we want the world to remain and consistent, like a, you know, like this zebra here, whose stripes never change, okay? Yet nothing in human experience is black and white, nor will anything remain like it is. The one thing guaranteed is change in our lives. Now is a time of transformation for some of you, as outer conditions are temporarily moving out of sync with your desires and expectations. So stay the course, and remember that even storms 
serve to clear the air and scatter seeds and nourish the soil for better things ahead. Life is about getting get, is about to get interesting, my friends. Anticipate it with curiosity as you wonder what is coming in on the shifting winds. The unknown is where the magic lies. So as you endeavor to create a prosperous life, you may encounter unexpected reversals that cause you to shift directions. This is a good thing. So there is nothing to fear. Perhaps an opportunity you sought went to someone else. Perhaps you've pursued something that you suddenly realized is not in your highest good. You may not be 100% clear on where you need to go, but you are certain that things are not going as planned. Circumstances are not in your control right now, so wait it out. All will be well, even better actually. Trust that the change is for the better. So that's not a bad message today, really. So you know what? I want you to stop worrying so much. I want you to realize that you have the ability to shift and change what it is in your life, even if it's your health. Uh, that's getting a second opinion. That's eating healthier, doing the things, you know, taking what it is you need to do. Perhaps, you know, you're, you're, you're take on a diet. Perhaps some of you are, are uh, adding more um, exercise to your daily activities. Uh, you're changing and shifting things up, okay? And this is the change that's coming in, perhaps, for some of you in that category. But I do see that things are going to change up today. You, things might not have gone as you planned them. Things might have, you know, uh, set you back and you thought, well, I wanted to do this and now this has happened. I can't do this. But know that it's for the better, okay? You, you'll look back hindsight uh, and realize, well, you know what? I'm glad this did happen because if it didn't, then that would have happened. You've been given as a beautiful card here, the final outcome, the spirit of the animals deck. And this is beaver spirit, laying a solid foundation. I, I love this deck. They're so graphic. They're so, the artist here is amazing. And uh, this is by Colette Baron reed And I do love her cards. So you know what? This is the power to establish the sacred connection with the universal consciousness so you can deliberately co-create the world as you desire. Know that it takes work, determination and sustained effort to co-create and lay a solid foundation for your dreams. It's not going to come into us and land at our feet today. So we've got to work towards our goals, put our head down and say, okay, I have to get this work done. Um, you know, basically, you, you know, you'll find that you can even change the direction of the flow uh, today. You can ensure that your world will be prosperous and purposeful, filled with love and joy, and rich with magic and meaning. That which you desire will come to you and remain sustainably if you build on a sturdy foundation. Keep your intention and energy consistent and deliberate, using all your resources and the energy of this wonderful productive time. Have faith for the spirit to co-create with you. Your success will be assured. Spirit is your partner, helping you along as you change the course of your life today and the way your heart desires. So, you know, this is all about, and I said this here with the, with the wind of change. So you may have, you have to put your head down here and shift, okay? Shift your energy a little bit. You may have been working on a situation today and all of a sudden now you went, oh, now I got to start over again. Uh, this wasn't going to work out. So now I'm going to have to build a, a more firmer foundation and it'll work out for the better to you, for you today. Well, my beautiful signs and souls of the zodiac, I want you to let go of worry today. I want you to realize that things are going to shift today and there may be change coming into you that you hadn't planned, but you're going to make it work out. Okay, you're going to make it work out because you have that ha ability to heal things, to heal yourself, to move through that, you know, spiritually, mentally, and emotionally, and physically to make these things work out in your favor today. Well, many blessings, my beautiful signs and souls of the zodiac. I wish you a beautiful day today. And I leave you with this again. The universe and the divine, your higher power, wants you to succeed and find your happiness and peace. So surrender to it and move forward towards your goals and happiness. Blessings, my beautiful souls, and know that I always and only stand in this circle of love and light for you. See you soon.